I'm here tonight with um, Jay Madison. Um, how's the weather in um, Nashville? Um, it's been pretty sunny so far. Actually, my car was frozen over this morning. So right. I was so surprised. Spooky. I looked out the, the window this morning and thought, it's going to be a beautiful, warm, and sunny day. And then we walked outside, and it was like 28 degrees this morning. So <laughs> I don't know what's happening this April, but it's fine. <laughs> Yeah, I used to live in uh, Murfreesboro, Tennessee. Oh. oh, okay, that's not too far away. <laughs> yeah, it, it was 28 miles from Nashville. Y'all were uh, a minute apart. Um, who's the oldest? Who do you think is the oldest? <laughs> <laughs> it's, um... The Madison. <laughs> oh um, yeah, <laughs> she's a minute older than me. Uh, yeah, one minute. It still counts though. I still hold it over her head, like when I was your age. Uh huh. You know? Okay. Um, what inspired you to be a part of the music industry? Well, you know, we've been singing since we were, you know knee high to a grasshopper um <laughs> and i mean there are even videos of us just at two years old dancing around the living room and singing annie songs um so it's just a passion for us it's fun we want we have a message to send out to people um and you know it's a dream job so we're gonna make it work it's really just a continuation <laughs> of of who we are honestly it just kind of naturally happened okay um in your uh, musical journey, um, what's the biggest um, problem you have um, encountered? Um, just knowing that, like, in the music industry, there's really not a formula for success. It's just sort of like throwing um, everything you've got in, a, like, a million different directions. And paving your own path. <laughs> and, yeah, yeah paving your own path, which is exciting, um, but also scary, you know, at the same time. Yeah, and I would also say, um, piggybacking off of that, that it's kind of, that self-doubt is definitely um, a hurdle to overcome, and especially whenever you kind of get in that headspace of competition as opposed to collaboration, um, it's which is really easy to do when you're surrounded by so many talented people. Um, but, you know, when you change that mindset to, wow, like I have so much to learn from everybody, then that's when you can really grow. Okay. I'm going to play your um, new single, um, Dale. Awesome. <laughs>
um, tell people about that song? Oh, well, first of all, thanks for playing it. We appreciate the support. Um, we wrote this as kind of just a fun and upbeat song about where we're from. We're from Southeast Texas, and it's really just about surrounding yourself with the things that ground you and family and, and everything that, you know, makes you happy whenever you kind of need to be brought back down to earth. You know, we were, we've been in Nashville for around uh, six years now, so... Um, this kind of just came at a time where we were homesick and we were just missing um, being in Texas and, you know, having nature all around us and things like that. So and also, you know, being in your 20s is just figuring out who you are um, and that can be scary. So um, it's like you can feel all over the place. And so finding that place where you're grounded is um, everything. And yeah. It's important. <laughs> um, are you planning to collaborate with any other artists? Um, we definitely are open to collaborating with other artists. Um, we typically, you know, write our songs together. Um, everything's just 50-50 with us. Um, but, you know, in the future, absolutely. Okay. Um, a instrument which you uh, like to learn and why? Which instrument would we like to learn? Yes. Um, I'd love to learn either guitar or bass. I play piano. Um, but guitar and bass have always, like, been so... They're just, like, really groovy instruments, but they it really hurts to play. So I've, like, hold, been holding off. But I do have a guitar, so I'm... I'm <laughs> step one. Step one. <laughs> What's your... Um, um useless um talent you have a useless a useless talent, talent. um <laughs> in general i just know like a bunch of weird facts about especially things. about friends she loves the show friends so she knows like random friends trivia although that's very useful like you know when we're going from <laughs> bar to bar for friends trivia you know getting prizes but i also <laughs> I don't know if this is considered a talent, but I can like shake my eyes really fast and it looks like I'm having a seizure. Well, that's... <laughs> I mean, that's I don't know if it's just a, like an ability. I don't know if that's a talent though. <laughs> well, every talent's kind of an ability. I mean, I, I don't know. <laughs> okay. um, where did you um, learn to sing, write, and um, play? Um, so singing, we naturally we're drawn to that from a young age and then we started taking lessons around like 12 um and we got involved in musical theater so that gave us like a good outlet to you know hone all of that um piano lessons i took around the same age a little earlier like nine but i definitely didn't practice the way i should have so i just sort of played around with it um and I'm wearing a lot now. by ear. Yeah, yeah, I play a lot by ear. Um, I can read music, but it's still not my my strong suit. Um, what was the other? It was singing, playing, and writing. Um, yes. And then we both started writing in high school. Yeah, we we started writing our senior year in high school. Some, you know, like they say, you kind of have to write like 50 horrible songs to get to a good song. So we were writing, you know, some stuff that will probably never see the light of day. But um, it definitely got us, you know, honed our skills. And then whenever we moved to Nashville, we were just surrounded by so many amazing writers. And it was just such an encouraging um, place to be for budding writers. And um, yeah, we just started digging in and started loving it and now you know there's no going back okay. um what's um y'all's um famous uh um musicians um uh, admire oh like a, a someone we admire yeah who's a musician um oh my gosh it's hard to pick just one but Janis Joplin, always and forever um, <laughs> she's from southeast texas like us yeah too, she's yeah. from port author um Let's see. Billy Joel's an amazing lyricist. Um, let's see. Bonnie Raitt. Um, yeah, Bonnie Raitt inspires us for sure. And then Ann um, Wilson from yeah, Heart. Ann she, Wilson. Yeah. Fleetwood um, Mac. So many people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, where can um, people go see your videos, music, and events? 
So you can find us online at J Madison Band, J A Y E Madison Band, and you can keep up with um, everything we've got going on, any upcoming interviews. We have a few upcoming live stream shows while we're all. Um, you know, safe at home for the time being. Uh, we do have a live stream coming up this Friday on our Instagram at 7.40 p.m. Central Time. So if you want to come uh, join us and hang out with us, that would be awesome. We would love to see you there. But yeah, just um, you can also find us, find information about us on our website at jmadison.com. And yeah, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, um, and Spotify. Somebody wanted to download um, down. Um, where would they go? Um, you can find the link to download in the bio of all of our um, social media platforms, and you can also just um, look us up on Spotify. And we're also on Apple Music, and um, basically every platform you can buy and listen to music. <laughs> well, thanks for um, being on the show tonight. I really enjoy talking to you and meeting you. Yeah. Well, it was great meeting you as well, and we really appreciate you inviting us on the show. Okay. Maybe sometime you can come by. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <absolutely. laughs> that'd be great. Okay. Bye. Bye. Bye.